Hey guys, I'm here with the next attempt, the second attempt of uh, United States state guessing, where I try to get 50 states correctly. Um, yeah, it is a challenge that um, the Twitch uh, user Chirapir has been doing for a while. He, he has more than 100 attempts at this. So, and... Um, yeah, his actual his actual best time now has improved to one hour and twenty five minutes, I think. So um, that's pretty pretty crazy, and it's um, probably hard to beat that without taking risks. But I mean, I would I would be happy already to just get the fifty states in a like one forty five would actually be amazing already. Mm, so. Uh, I won't have three hours today, so I might eventually have to take risks. Plus, I'm not sure if I'm as patient today as I was last time. So, I have no idea how long that video is gonna take. <laughs> so, um, it's probably best to avoid uh, looking at the time bar in, on YouTube. Um, but yeah, of course that's true for ge in general for videos like that. Uh, Jackson, oh Florida, yeah, okay, yeah, makes sense, makes sense. No, oh, why did I not start the round? Oh fuck, that happened to me the second time now. Um, let's go back to the start, right? And we just drive this stretch again, and we go until we find a sign, right? I hope. Where was it? <clears throat> was it? Is it over here? Huh. Or did I go the other way? I'm not sure anymore. But I kind of have to travel at least as long, otherwise it would be kind of cheating. So I guess I guess we're good now because I'm pretty sure I haven't traveled more than that. Right? Huh. It's not here. So okay. Next, uh oh, what is this? Exit 85. We cannot exit, okay. This feels, this reminds me of a place in Wyoming. Yeah, exit one, then left on Yellowstone. Uh, Wyoming. Yeah, I, I think I risk it because it doesn't have to be Wyoming, but it is very likely. Um, okay, a lot of flags on there. University Avenue. Oh, that doesn't sound too bad, because universities can give away the state sometimes. Feels hard to narrow this town to region. This feels like a lot of the states that are kind of east central ish. So it's very hard to. It, it doesn't feel southern to me, but it's not impossible that it still is. But I would rather think like maybe Indiana or something like that on this one. Wait, what is that? Fire of what? What? Karen Crow? What? I have never heard this. What an interesting town name though. This is one that you can remember once you know it. Lone Star. Are we in Texas? Mm, I'm not convinced at all, to be honest. I'm not gonna take the risk here. 
Schools of the Sacred Heart. Oh, Louisiana. Oh, Louisiana. Well, okay, it is actually in the south. Wow. Okay. Interesting. Uh, okay. So a lot of brick houses here. Oh yeah, a lot of brick houses equals Texas. Makes sense. What? Hello? Give it to me. Okay, fine. Okay, another one of those. Like those are such. Those can be so many states, man. That was really surprising that the other one was Louisiana. I didn't get that vibe at all. But then again, it was very southern. But even there, you should get a very specific, it's a very specific area. Hmm. So we're at four minutes now. Do we have here two SC thirty four? Yeah, uh, yeah. South Carolina is possible here. I guess I'm gonna take it. Okay, great. Next one. Okay. Oh, interesting uphill here. Hmm. Oh wow, this may I like this road. <laughs> it's kind of major. Hey, the snow cars. What the heck? What kind of rural place is this? Um, can I get to that road somehow? Pleasant Ridge. What is this? Entering reserve something NX something. Not sure if I want to go there, if that's better or not, but I think rather not. So let's try something else. Whoa, that's a nice neighborhood here. We have those Kentucky style fences, but that doesn't have to be Kentucky just because there's one. Interesting kind of road color. Can you see that kind of orange tone in it? That's rather interesting. Doesn't feel like the normal color. Not sure if that tells us something. Um, yeah, mm, this is a rural place. Even though a main road seems to go through here, but we don't know where exactly that is. Wow! Did you see that post? I'm not gonna waste my time on it, but that looked very unusual. So this could be southern. I could see that. In the south, maybe, but maybe not. How do I get to the fucking road? I just tried to always cross it until I can reach it, maybe. I think it was this way. So now at least we're in a decent town. Bolton. Bolton, that might be the town name, but that's such a boring name, so... Welcome to Wildcat's country. Wildcat? That makes me think... Carolinas, but... I mean, it's just an animal, so... Yeah, we're Bolton High School now. Bolton High School, and that's the Wildcat, I assume. It almost looked like South Carolina or something. Oh, uh, what do we have? No, I don't want to check trucks because that's so unreliable and therefore a waste of time. <clears throat> okay, I guess we will be traveling on this one. Last time, uh, location number eight, I think was the bad one in, Cal in California. Oh, wow, blurry. This side as well? No, okay, interesting. That is very interesting. Merrill Road, Mill Arlington, Arlington, sounds like Texas, but uh, I don't know, I could see Arkansas on this one actually very well, 
Baptist church, it seems. <laughs> Soybeans, maybe? Hmm. All right. Pretty rough to find this one out. Oh, we have Tennessee. Okay. Probably Western Tennessee. <laughs> yeah. Mississippi round. Oh, this is interesting, to be honest. But it, it will depend a lot on <laughs> going the right way. I see some hills over there, so I try not to go there. Ah, I think I use my auto movement here to rest my hands. But I might miss a sign, so... Uh, but it's not going that fast, so it's all right. Should be able to see it. <gasps> there was something, but probably nothing. Uh, yeah, it's an adopter highway sign, which they, they can be helpful but this one doesn't show any like state flower or anything so we're gonna continue so obviously it's a western state but it it's it doesn't feel very deserty it's just very dry but still some kind of green it feels like so i could see this in colorado maybe or New Mexico maybe as well. Saratoga High School. FBLA. What the heck does that mean? It's not Louisiana. All right, this might take a while as well. So after the first challenge, this challenge seems to be much uh, rougher. What else could this be? I mean, it's not extremely dry, but it is dry. There's not many options. Maybe, maybe Oregon and Washington is also a possibility and Idaho. Cause yeah, th this does not feel very Southern, like Southwestern. Hmm. Hmm. Weird. Fish hatchery. What the heck? How is there fish here? <clears throat> That's interesting. Maybe that gives me some hope that we can find it fast. If there's fish, there must be a lake or water, which means there might be more population which might mean it's more signs. But who knows, who knows. Oh, Wyoming. Um, yeah, that makes sense as well. Even though it's not typical Wyoming, but... Okay. Close to Colorado that was, right? I think if I seen that correctly. Mm, 95. Rich Road, Newport and Plymouth. Isn't that all New e Northeastern? New Englandish? Entering Newport. Newport. 95 Newport. 95 Plymouth. Is Newport here somewhere? Feels like I've heard that before. Um, Newton. I'm really scared of these northeastern areas. They really drives me nuts. Don't want to take the risk here. Richard, Newport, and Plymouth. So where's 195 from here in Plymouth? But Plymouth is not here where the 95 is. 
that is kind of scary. Cause this might there might be more than one Plymouth. Uh, freaking hell. Hmm. I don't know. How do I find the state? So weird. Two two. Ninety five. Ah, I'm so scared of those things. Banger? Oh no. Is it Maine? Maine is such a scary state. Yeah, it feels extremely northern, northeastern. So it might be. Where's the two? There's no. No, oh, there is. Huh. But where's Plymouth then? There needs to be Plymouth. Which sounds like a coastal town, right? But I don't know. I lose a lot of time here, but uh, this is a very risky round in my opinion. Um, <clears throat> how do I get to two? Because actually I want that. I want that. Uh, I don't get it. Oh wait. Oh wait, 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 wait. Ah, it's one of those boring, yeah. Definitely could be main blue signs for stuff like that. That's very unusual. Oh, this should be good. Skohegan, Newport, the two and the 95. Where do those come together? Where's the two? Newport. Yeah, that should be it, right? It's still the hundred is here. Yeah, it's main. It's main. Makes sense. Landscape wise, it didn't feel like Massachusetts at all. Like after seeing it for a while, it was like uh, clear. We have a tractor here. That's always good because it's a good meme. Antiques. Hmm. So this feels more like Pennsylvania or something like that. The hills feel kind of Appalachian, but it's also not extremely hilly. It's like, yeah, buildings don't look Southern to me so far. So Pennsylvania is a very good guess that I actually would be quite uh, much more willing to risk on a round like this, to be honest, because I really feel like Pennsylvania is one of those states that has some very unique um, things that make it look different than like New York State is already completely different in my opinion. I mean, of course, maybe not the border areas of, but um, yeah, the surrounding states are very different. Like West Virginia, of course, is in general much more hilly mountainous than Pennsylvania. But uh, yeah, it, I think it also has to do with the buildings in Pennsylvania that usually, uh, gets me on the Pennsylvania train while it and it's often the landscape plus the architecture that makes me think it's possible that it could be Pennsylvania but man that's another round where we really need to drive a long time it seems so hmm where is it oh boy Vermont uh, Vermont is risky because it's such a small state so we need to make sure that we actually didn't cross a state line so we have Vermont 30 and why is there another road here that is not a Vermont that's uh, very weird and very scary so where's Vermont 30 I don't know oh it's here 
And 315 ends here. So that should be possible to find, right? Um, Thirty is here. Three fifteen is here, and I went east. Oh uh oh. We need to find out where we started. This is risky. This is risky. I need to find the exact place. Well, I go the other way. And maybe I find a road name here close by. Or maybe we cross the border. Then we know that we're actually still in Vermont. But not convinced at all to be honest Paulette Mountain so we we go west and we reach Paulette Mountain Paulette Road what mm, is this the same or not oh it's here okay so we are in Vermont that's good Red, well, Radcliffe Court and Radcliffe Road wow that's an interesting round we're in the northwest that's for sure so this is either washington or oregon but it feels more washington to me but of course both of those have high mountains so it's not easy well we we can look at the speed sign and if they say speed limit it should be washington mendenhall wastewater mendenhall haven't I heard of that? Ah, oh, the road ends here. I don't like that. So let's go towards the mountains. Yeah, I think it's a little bit risky though, because what if it's Northern California? Then I'm kind of screwed. Uh, no, I went this way again. What? That sucks. Glacier, Glacier, Highway, interesting, all right, I think this is the better road, wow, there's a lot of traffic, Egan Drive and Glacier, yeah, we should have this soon, I think, uh, classic Northwestern architecture there, <laughs> in my opinion, I just saw it on the side of my view. Whoa! Oh no! Is it Alaska? Really? Oh yeah! Th th those mountains are very treeless. Wow! You know and Oak Bay. What is Oak Bay? Yeah, I mean, we're in this region. That's not like classic. Um, Classic Alaska. It still has some similarities with the Northwest. But I don't see that thing, Oak Bay, so. Hmm. Yeah, it's kind of weird. What? Is there something called Glacier up here? Glacier Bay. Mott Bay. Maybe Oak Bay is in Canada, but probably not. Huh. So Juneau is north? No, it's east actually. Hmm. What a weird place, man. Glacier Highway and the Vintage. Glacier Highway. Isn't this or something also called Glacier Highway? Not sure anymore. Glacier View? No, that's Glen Highway. Hmm. I don't know, man. I'm fairly certain it's Alaska, but we can check the plates maybe. Because we should have a lot of yellow plates then. But we have a lot of traffic, man, for Alaska. That's also kind of weird. Um, but it should be, right? Because what else should it be? Mendenhall. Problem is I don't see it. What a weird round. 
This is scaring me. Is there any possibility that Juno could be indicated here? Not really, right? So I think I'm gonna risk it. Yeah, yeah I have to because it's stupid. Okay, I was here. So close to Juno. And that's why the traffic is. Yeah, makes sense. Alright. Was wasting a little bit of time there, but oh, what the heck. <laughs> oh, oh, this building has seen its best times. Corley. And do we have anything other? Besides that, uh, yeah, I don't know. Hmm. <clears throat> what is this? Speed limit. I almost forgot about the Alaska man. Good I didn't do that speed, speed limit stuff. Trying to find out whether it's Oregon or not, because they might have killed me. What? One north. Is this Kentucky? Because, uh. Or Mississippi. Ah, Mississippi. Stereotype. Stereotype building there at the start. So it might be the Mississippi area actually. Because this doesn't feel like the typical Mississippi. Oh, Clarksdale. Isn't that there somewhere? Clarksdale. No? It sounds so familiar. Hmm, I don't know. Oh wow, this region is doing terrible. Wow, that's really, really bad. And that's clock still again, of course. The, yeah, Mississippi area is quite poor, which is so weird to me because if you have so much good area for fields, how can you be so poor? How is that even possible? I mean, I know agriculture is not the most lucrative thing, but... Coahoma! That's just like one of those weird town name mixes. What starts with Co? That's weird. Ahoma sounds like... Sounds like it has something to do with Oklahoma. Uh-oh. Oh. Man, look at the buildings here. What is this? I'm not sure if i ever seen something like this in the US, to be honest. This is really bad. I mean, you see big bad buildings in some of the big cities as well. But just... The, the percentage of bad buildings that we saw is now really crazy. What is that road? Ah, uh, no. Ah, fuck it. I don't want to waste my time with that. I actually would like to know what road this is because it kind of might be a stage road. Freer's point. Those are also weird speed speed limit signs. Something is wrong with the font. I mean, it's different. Yeah, this this. Uh, oh, yeah, this says Mississippi, right? It has to be Mississippi limestone. What are the odds? It's Kentucky. Kentucky is scuffed as well sometimes, but I don't think it's here. Yeah, it's right next to Mississippi. As I said. All right, this neighborhood feels much better. I cannot even see the houses, but I can already feel it. That was some scuffed place, man. But very interesting. Everything that's like a little bit off the norm is interesting in GeoGas, right? Ah, Kentucky style fences. Uh, it's quite hilly. It 
feels a little bit southern to me, definitely. So, what is that flag? Maybe some sports thing. Yeah, most likely. Ebersol and Rich. Rich. Are we in the rich region? Whoa, that's an interesting view. And that's some nice cabbage or whatever that is. Huh, that's an interesting view. Yeah, it feels like Kentucky, Tennessee is definitely, definitely very possible. 717, we don't know what that is. Wait, we have boats and they sometimes have the state on it. Actually, they do have to have it. But I'm not sure how they are issued. Whoa, we have two boats that say PA. This says also PA. Alright, yeah, that makes sense. So we're in the very mountainous part. We're in the rich, in the rich region of Pennsylvania. That makes sense. Um, do I really want to go for that? Because what if this person purchased the boats in Pennsylvania? Or he's naturally from there? But this is actually not. It's a little bit risky. And I don't like risks. <laughs> But yeah, the buildings, look, that's not southern. That's that's such classic architecture for this region. Uh, uh, yeah, evangelical. But I'm really scared. Because I also don't know if I... This is a neat town, pretty interesting. If I never East Cocalico Township Township hmm. PA has townships, I think. Yeah, it's PA. Uh, yeah, I think I didn't cross the border, right? Oh, okay, correct. Wow, that was so far east in PA. Whoa, that was that's surprising to me. Thirty-five. Hmm. Not sure where thirty-five runs. Clear Creek. Oh, Kearney. Isn't that Nebraska? But I'm not sure. Thirty-five could run through Nebraska. Oh, Missouri. Kearney, 35, Kearney, it's 35 here, yeah, uh, has to be here, right, because I didn't travel w very far, wow, that's just outside of Kansas City, okay, nice sign, right there, ah, oh, but interesting landscape, this uh, is not such classic. It feels a little bit dry, but it has a lot of trees. So does that indicate we're in the very west, like California? Ooh, a lot of farms, big farms. Definitely feels like California now. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I could risk it here, but I'm not going, going to. China Creek. Wait, haven't I been at this pl exact place? China sounds so familiar. <laughs> and I don't mean the country. I've seen China in the US before, but I think there's also more than one China. Because why not when you don't know any town names, you just call it China. An Annadale Riverbend. Hmm. Such classic California. No? Whoa, interesting hill there. But I'm not convinced yet. Oh, 
it says CA. Hmm, <laughs> should I risk it or not? Ah, we're at 15 at the moment. Hmm, can we risk it one time? Let's check this car. Do we overtake it? New Holland. Isn't that a Michigan thing? <laughs> but uh, do we have mountains in the east? This is interesting there. Oh, not really. Hmm. Like this. Could this be Oregon? Hmm. It's so unlikely, but it is not impossible. But such big farms, I cannot remember seeing that ever there. Plus, it is quite dry. And Oregon can be dry, but it's usually not dry plus very agricultural. Uh, apples? Apples, though. Oh, then I need to be careful, maybe. Because apples, they do have a lot of apple farms in Washington. So maybe I need to take a little bit of care there. We have a palm though. Why would there be a palm in Oregon? Oh, there's the confirmation. We need that. We're in the Central Valley somewhere. Yeah, east of Fresno. <laughs> All right. Southern Comfort Boulevard. Southern Comfort is also some kind of alcoholic beverage, right? I'm not sure which state it is from. I think so it could be Tampa International 275 it has to be Florida right yeah if there's 275 needs to be um, all right another one is done Mac tank we have signs already. Ashland. Eh, Hanover. Westchester, Ohio. Ashland. Why does Ashland not sound like an Ohio town name to me? But it might be. Oh, what does this say? It says Ashland. What is that weird? Uh, kind of sign that said 54 95 95 does 95 go through Ohio mm. no no interesting never trust trucks um but where does this place oh it's 95 in Kentucky then. No? Huh. Interesting. That is sure is interesting. Freaking Ashland. I've heard this, this town name before. Washington. What? Let's say, oh boy, are we in Virginia? Yeah, with those kind of... Holy shit! Man, it doesn't feel like Washington DC here. There's Ashland, yeah, should be. Unless it's another Ashland. But alright, oh, that's some nice houses. Holy shit. And a lot of brick. A lot of brick. Does it mean it's Texas? I don't know. Doesn't feel like the typical Texas brick style. Edgemont Park. Wow, that's a good picture quality. Man. Lakewood. 214 area code. I almost know no area code, so. Uh, hmm. Very interesting town. Which might be called Lakewood, but that, that's probably a hundred Lakewoods in the US. 
that's so common for smaller towns as well, I think. Prospect celebration, White Rock. White Rock, hmm. Wait, why did they? Oh, is that a Whole Foods? Uh, makes sense with this area. Bus stop. Richmond. Abrams. VCA. Lakewood Animal. Hmm. Richmond. This could mean we're in Virginia or a state close by, but it doesn't have to mean anything. What is this saying? Man, well, what a fancy town. Mm. Speed limit 35. That's very slow. Hmm. No, we're not gonna do that. Um, surprisingly hard to find out more. I expected to have a sign pretty quick, but not really. For Dallas City Council, this Dallas. I mean, we had a lot of brick sign, uh, brick houses, but I don't know. It doesn't feel like Dallas to me, but. Sure, might be. I mean, it feels so extremely suburban that uh, Texas. Yeah, we are in Dallas, man. Are we in the northern suburbs, or where is this fancy neighborhood? Yeah, it's in the north. Uh, Lake Lakewood Heights. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Fisher snow plows. Are we back to the northeast? My my scary, scary traumatic experience from last time in this region. Very scary place because there's a lot of smaller states that makes it even harder and it's the region I know the least about in the US. So it is very scary to get such locations. Veggies, duck eggs. <laughs> they have duck eggs and ducklings. <laughs> oh, what do we have here? What? New, New Hampshire? Wait, that's so unclear though. Well, it probably is, but I cannot remember having seen that anywhere. Oh yeah, that's New Hampshire, right? New Hampshire 10. I hope I didn't cross any, any state line. Where's 10? Here. This, oh, oh boy, 10 is right on the, the border here. And I went... Ah, God damn it, I may need to make sure it's not going to be... Vermont again. Gilson, Marlowe, and Surrey, and what else? And Keene. Ha, <laughs> Keene. I had this place before. I forgot where it is. Oh, there's there's Keene, actually, but Keene is, could be very far. There's Marlow. Marlow, Gilson, and Surrey. So. It's not possible that we started in Vermont. I think not. I took a very, very tiny risk there, but it was so unlikely. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait a second, sir. What is this? Joseph Hunter, more access. What is that, a pig or what? Uh, we have blue county signs. So that usually means we're in the east or midwest somewhere. Midwest has that a lot, right? 
E E. So E six T sixty two going through here. There's all kind of sixty numbers here, and I in Wisconsin. The sixty one. But if there's no 62, and it really feels like it could be misery, there's no 62 here, right? And maybe check quickly where they come together. I mean, 62 is down here. But they don't seem to come together, that's actually weird. But it's not unusual, um, because that's how it always is, right? Oh boy, what the heck, man. Don't scare me like that. Freaking, freaking tip of Missouri. Holy shit. Oh, man. New York style barn, in my opinion, that is. I think we're back in the northeast. A lot of northeast today. I don't like it. But I rather have them now than in the end. <laughs> Lawrence. Oh boy, this is cancer. It's not good. Yeah, I think we cannot go here. No, we can't. It's not nice. Main Street? Are you kidding me? What is this Main Street? Yeah, this feels very New Yorkish. Can you see the difference between the PA that we had and this one? Feels very different, right? Even though they're next to each other. I mean, they're huge states by themselves, so. But we have to make sure it's not, it's definitely north of Pennsylvania, I would say. But I am not the one that likes to rule out any states northeast. So it's probably New York, Connecticut, Massachusetts, Rhode Island. Uh, probably one of those. Rather unlikely to be in New Hampshire, Vermont, and Maine because, uh, for one thing, this seems decently populated, even though it's so forested. It feels decently populated. Um, but yeah, Maine. Oh boy. Maine does. Those states sometimes have a little bit of a colder feel. I'm not going here. No way, going back. Uh, last time I passed the house. Well, this time I'm not gonna do that. So it would be way too risky to go for New York here, even though I think we have like a two, two out of three chance that this is gonna be New York. And we have a lot of blurries, and New York has a lot of blurries, you wouldn't think, but there's such a huge divide in the state between New York City and the whole other upstate area. It's it's like some completely different states, like, it's so crazy. And this this, but this still st feels more East East New York to me than West, because West New York is very different, right? Uh, that's, it's more like very flat there and not that forested. Boxford, 
Maybe I should check plates because New York has yellow ones. If I see a lot of them, but this is not yellow. This is also not yellow. What? Okay, maybe I don't check that. Maybe it is Connecticut or Massachusetts after all. I've seen similar forests in Massachusetts as well, but I really felt like from the building style, it might be a little bit different still. Oh boy, this is taking a long time. Man, I'm on pace for two hours plus again. No, god damn it! Are you kidding me? What the heck, man? Yeah, this is better. Wait, what was that sign? This location. F I, I hate this region. I hate it. <laughs> it's so hard to find anything. There's too many road windings and there's too many... Ah, it's just... Ah, and they, never, they never have signs like how far is it from here to there. They never do that here. What is always this shit? It's annoying as fuck. Kelsey. Ah oh boy, this takes a long time and I don't like it. Hmm, maybe I need to check such signs. Maybe this says New York. No? Another one that is not a yellow plate. I think we need to bury the New York because it ain't happening, I think. Uh, Georgetown. Hmm. Well, it would be nice if you could also tell us the state. But of course not. Tennis court. It's a rather wealthy region, even though the buildings don't feel that amazing but to me but this area is probably this might be a suburb of a bigger city or it might just be very close to the coast and th these areas are very expensive to live in uh, just one bank you can't be two, right? Mini golf, ice cream, and shrubs. <laughs> what the heck, man? They never. S There's no state road. <sighs> Give me the state. Did I go north for a long time or did I switch? I didn't check that, which is really bad. Really bad on my end. Nice bear. Hey, there's no yellow plates here. Oh, like one I've seen. <laughs> so, this might be Massachusetts. Quite a bit away from New York. Massachusetts also has those signs. And it's actually, it's not New York because they have their own stuff. Georgetown, man, where is Georgetown though? Should I check for it on the map? What is faster? Andover. Hmm. Free 
Lake in Georgetown. Oh, that's a good sign. North Groveland, East Raleigh. Didn't I see Raleigh before? Hmm. Tops Field. Um, and we have 95 again, so Tops Field. Oh, Georgetown. <clears throat> okay. Um, where did I travel? Boxford. I th think we did. Yeah, we didn't come from up here. No, we didn't. Yeah, we came out of Boxford. And that is, yeah, it you it this is kind of like Boston suburbs, very far outside of it, but like it's not far away from the state border, so pretty risky. It's a pretty scary place. So let's not do more northeast. Yeah, I'm actually more happy about this because when I find a sign, I will have it. Oh boy, the camera. Do I really want to go this way? When I get a sign here, I will know where we are instantly. It's just a matter of how long does it take to find a sign. Mm. Hmm, what does this feel like? This feels like very much like the one that we had before in Wyoming, right? It is green, but we just have those little shrubs and no trees. And it doesn't feel like deserty hot, so it might very well be Wyoming again. Or Colorado, or... There's not many options for landscape like this. Maybe New Mexico, but it would be a little bit unusual for New Mexico. There's not many possibilities, so it has to be either Wyoming or Colorado. Colorado is also one of those scary states because it can look very... Uh, Colorado has so many sub-regions. You need to be really be careful not to assume that everything in, the Colo in Colorado is Rocky Mountains. There's extremely flat parts. There's parts that are rather deserty, there's very mountainous parts, there's so many different areas. So I could see both for that. Hmm. Yeah, I think everything else is not possible. Maybe Utah, but close to border, but um, it's, it's unlikely, it's unlikely. I think it also feels weird for Oregon, like Eastern Oregon. I don't know, I don't get that feel. But yeah, it's not easy. And apparently there's no sign upcoming. So, I guess we let it run until we get a sign. Wait. Texas. Oh, I didn't consider that. Oh, wow. This does not feel like typical Texas to me, but I can see it now a little bit, but that's interesting. Um, yeah, I probably did not cross the border. I don't know where we are. Oh, we are near Amarillo. Wow. Okay. Interesting, I didn't consider Texas there. Yeah, you always need to consider Texas. But usually this area is much drier in my experience, but it might just had much more rain recently, so there was more green stuff. 426. Man, we get very hard state signs. This this um this fifty ch state challenge, always like square or circle, cocks, cocks. 
back pain. You need cocks. Got drugs. No, you need cocks. Kentucky. Probably, right? Lebanon, Kentucky. Let's make sure it's not New York. Mm. Hey, it can't be New York. If there's a 68 in Kentucky, then it is Kentucky. Yeah. Lebanon. I've heard that before, actually. Oof, that's an interesting brick wall. Oh, we're in a nice region again. Wow, if you can afford walls to made out of these bricks, man, you really made it. Holy shit. You kidding me? This is insane. So, is Texas possible here? Yeah, I think. Hmm. We have cows. What is that? Oh, we have county roads, so it's not Texas. Tipper, Tipper, huh? Interesting. Uh, do I want to go there or not? Baptist Church. Okay. No, I don't want. I want to stay here. So I'm gonna go south. This could be Arkansas, cause it feels like similar to some areas in Texas, but I'm not sure does Arkansas use those blue? It could be that they don't use that. I don't know, it feels like they would not be a state that uses those signs. For some reason, I think that. Uh, but yeah, that's just like stereotype thoughts. So, gotta re get rid of that bullshit, right? So, let's find hard clues. Kind of Kentucky style fence. Hmm. Very interesting place, man. Especially those nice houses. Now it's not as nice anymore. <laughs> we spawned in the right area of town, apparently. Mm -hmm. Hey. Why does it look so... so dark brownish? Doesn't it usually look much paler? So that seems weird. Huh. Uh, what is that? Man, I need to get faster. I'm so slow. So slow. But I want to make it to 50. And it's not Texas, so I mean, um, Eastern Oklahoma does. I see that region so rarely in GeoGuessers, so uh, it might also be that. Because we, we have Baptist churches here, so we are somewhere in the south, I think. That's the second one already, so. It's either that or like maybe also Mississippi because they sometimes have those brick style from Texas imported I think <laughs> they also I've seen some sick neighborhoods in Mississippi so we shall see but man this place does not sign anything does it 
Hmm. That is some weird thing. Tipa County. We know the county and I've heard that before. But you can I have no idea. It's so hard to remember county names. I mean this one is a little bit special because it sounds like it could be a word that is coming from um in from the indigenous people of America. Some kind of language from there. It doesn't sound English at all. <laughs> a nice car. Which might be yeah, maybe it's Oklahoma. They have a lot of tribes and stuff. But it's definitely not the classic uh, thing that we get in Oklahoma. Man, this place. How is it possible to not find anything? Mister. I hope we don't cross the border or something. Because they probably don't even sign that here. It feels like <laughs> they don't sign anything. Wow, man, this takes so long. I never expected this to take long. North Haven, man, that has so boring name. What are you doing? Beaver Dam. Everyone calls Beaver something. We we travel to Union County now. Haunted Forest. That's where all the signs are hidden. They just took them and stole them and put it in the forest. Do you have some kind of stuff on you? Not that I want to trust it, but I would like to get a first, at least an idea. Uh, Southern real estate. Well, yeah, Southern can mean the South as in the US, but it can also mean South of a specific state or maybe south of Union County. <laughs> oh boy, this location makes me really funny, I think. What is this place, man? It's decently populated, but it also has a lot of trees. But there's no signs. How is that possible? <laughs> Freaking troll round. And the sign, it's, the camera is crap quality. Freaking hell. Where are we? Are you kidding me? Warning. Do not read the sign or you will go to a haunted forest. North, now we are north side. North side. <laughs> bin. Useless bin. Yeah, of course, we're not in a big city, so bins are useless. Trash. Just complete trash. Now we even get road work. We don't need that. Oh. I like this road. 15 circle Mississippi probably now how can I be sure uh, county something I need to drive this road. We had 15, right? Well, what happened? Climate change? <laughs> eh, does Mississippi use the blue, th blue stuff? Do they? I'm not convinced, to be honest. Ah, boy. 15. Uh...
come on. Man, I'm not even halfway in. North Haven. Freaking hell. We might be in the more hilly area of uh, Mississippi, which is the Mississippi area, I think. Oh, nice. Wait, what? Don't tell me I don't know any of those. Oh, no. I don't know. I've heard Ripley before, but that might be another one. Uh, let's check for 15, maybe. There's 14. Because it's probably this state. But what if it's Kentucky? Yeah, it is risky to just... Blue Mountain in 13 north. Uh, what else is there? Walnut. And yeah, we definitely Mississippi. We're in the northern... Yeah, Ripley, right. Northern Mississippi, man, that took a while. Oh, we're on the 75, the road that goes through Atlanta. Neat, but this is not Atlanta at all. But I know the road goes to Michigan, and we're in Tennessee. All right, scrubs. Uh, all right, we're in this part. Okay, that was fast, that was nice. And yeah, all right. We didn't get as much uh, Midwestern locations this time. We had a lot of them last time, right? In Iowa and stuff. In Illinois, we haven't seen those states so far. Oh, nice building. It's quite dry, but it might just be um, summer or something. It doesn't feel very hot. To be honest, hot climate. Oh, Dakota, the <laughs> North Dakota 32. Mm, I guess I don't need to check anything here, right? We went east. Yeah, it should be North Dakota. Okay, good. Good. So we're halfway in now, and we have one hour, ten minutes. Man, I need to hurry. Oh boy, this feels like we're in the south. Bad roads. Horses. What is this? See Waverly Waverly Hall. Click it or ticket. That's Georgia, right? I've heard of Waverly before. Uh, I think it's somewhere down here. No. Where's Waverly? I am sure that this is here, right? Yeah, it should be. Whew, boy, so close to the border always. Oh, it's close to Columbus. All right. Oh, that looks like good picture quality here. Cracks stump removal. ABC something. Uh, interesting water there. Hmm, water that runs along here. That's something that's pretty rare, a rare sight. So this almost reminds me of some national parks in Florida that, that I've seen. But it doesn't feel like it's sandy. The soil doesn't seem sandy. And if it's if it's Florida, it's gonna be northern, because I don't get any Florida vibe at this moment in time. Um, yeah, houses are not the best here. 
again well, that's so interesting we still have that water on the side of the road now it's dried up what oh no it's still there huh uh bridge 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 a <laughs> big creek yes it's big it's a big creek but where mm -hmm. what is this sign adopt the highway what Poyen High School Beta Club? Why are you not Alpha? Speed limit forty. Forty. That seems like I don't know. No engine brake. No engine brake. I, I've seen that in Georgia as well. Poyan Indians. Why are you making profit of Indians? Home of the Indians. Uh, what is this place, man? Hmm. Ah, wait, 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 scoop us. Ah, it's just this poem. What, a, what an interesting town name. Oh, we have 53 degrees in on December 31st. That is not extremely warm, but it sure is not cold. Arkansas Yeah, I guess that is sure makes sense All right, oh Alabama That's a very generous oh Wow, okay, I stay here we're gonna quit the 50 state challenge. Wow, two blurry houses, man. So anti Google. That's interesting. Pretty sure the town name is on there. Marble, marble. What? Why does it not say marble? <laughs> nice, someone got a new TV. It's always nice. Uh, I, I have no idea what this architecture is like. It's very brick heavy, but ah, Lexington, Kentucky. Is that already good enough of a clue? Isn't Lexington close to Boulder? That's a little bit scary. Yeah, decently, but it, this is probably Lexington. Because I know this, this, this city is so nice, man. Like it's crazy. When I added places on my southern neighborhoods map, I noticed the the city where it was easiest to find nice neighborhoods is Lexington. I don't know. This is like it's just a sick place, man. Feels like everybody's rich here. Is it the capital of Kentucky? What is the capital? Yeah, I'm not sure. Whoa, 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 whoa. Can you also say Kentucky? Good year. USDOT. We don't care about USDOT. Ah, they empty the blue bins. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, we are there. Just want to make sure. Do not blow it again. 
Oh boy, what is this? This reminds me of Texas. Uh, mainly the landscape, not the buildings here, somehow. Some of those areas that are not that far away from the coast. Oh, okay, what is this? <laughs> uh, not sure if we're going that way then. Mm hmm. Yeah, we have bricks. Even on the easier buildings. Uh, DeKalb city limit. I know there is DeKalb County in Georgia, but the, there's no city of that, I think. This is also uh, speed limit 60. Oh, what is this water tower? What? WSC? What the heck? Why do you use abbreviations? Is your town name that long? It's not good. Radiant life. Looks like Baptist. Hmm. This is an interesting area. Welcome to the Cobb. So once I have this 50 run complete, then next time I can play played with high risk. Texarkana College. Oh boy. Uh, I know it's here. But the problem is this town is actually in both states. And that's quite not nice. Um, so I might need to, to, to 5k this or at least find out where I am because it's risky. That's Texas. We're in Texas now. But we're going east so it's very possible that we started also in Texas. But how do I find out? Man, the starting location was shit. Like, there is no real road there. Oh boy. Mm. Tulsa, Oklahoma. Ah, Texas flag. I mean, it's very likely going to be in Texas, but it's too risky because it's Texarkana. Oh, it's all right. We came from the Cobb, right? So maybe that's findable. I forgot about that. Is it even here? I don't see it. Where is the cob? I don't see that, so maybe that's not a good... That doesn't make me feel good. Uh, phew. The cob? Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Very weird. Clarksville. Where's Clarksville? Here? So it must be here somewhere. There it is. Could I have started across? Not really, right? Where did I go from the start? Uh, here, south. Ooh. Hmm. Damn. I actually went south. And I always forget when I cross rivers. But it's, it's, is this already the main road? Yeah, the Cobb City Limit. Yeah, yeah, we are here, we are here. Actually, I wasted some time there, but yeah, I don't want to do make a drama like last time. <laughs> That's what we don't want, right? Next one. We are now at 30, so 20 more. Uh, Tate Lane, written by yourself or what? Uh, your town doesn't have money 
for signs, but you can afford such houses. That seems like a rare combination in the US. I've seen it in Argentina, especially people making their own signs because the government signs are shit. <laughs> they just let them run, run down or like if they're painted on, they don't do anything. Ain't no budget for that. But in the US, hmm, usually the signs are pretty good. Oh boy, we're in some kind of countryside. And it scares me that it feels a little bit northeastern again. Oh, a new house, who this? Uh, Foss? I don't know where to go here. This feels very northern. Oh yeah. We have those red Swedish style houses. Those are rather common in the northeast. Rarely see them in any, any other area really. I think. So anything from P Pennsylvania to Maine, I cannot even 100% exclude. Uh, Northwest, mm. it is very unlikely to be there. But this could also be Minnesota, but it's also very unlikely. So. So this seems to be the main road. We found that at least. This should be a stage road in my opinion. But the buildings, they don't make me think Minnesota at all. So I'm still quite confident that we are in the Northeast. Or Pennsylvania. Is Pennsylvania still considered Northeast? Interesting question. Because New East doesn't have to be the same like New England, right? Everything that is New England is automatically not Northeast, but Northeast stretches further than the New England region, I would say. At least it's my logic. Oh, there's traffic. I think we're gonna choose this lane. So we go east and now we go south. Wait, maybe this road name tells us something. Range E. Oh boy. That is not very telling. Speed limit 50. We still didn't get New New York State. Yeah, we didn't. I think in the last round we did. We did get it there. So I can't remember the state sign. State road sign. Chase. State inspections. 2 you also provide stickers? Hmm. Well, well, well. It's another one of those roads. Like, what was the other one? Was that in Massachusetts? Or the one in Vermont? Which one took so long? I forgot. So what states did we not have so far? We didn't have Washington and Oregon, I think. We didn't have Iowa, Illinois. Uh, I should better focus on the game, not think about that. Um, what else? We had Alabama, Mississippi, Georgia, Florida, South Carolina. We didn't have North Carolina, I think. Oh, South 5. Yeah, that confirms my my Northeastern. 
now we just need to find out which state that is we're on the five and I don't like it because that's another one of those exactly same landscape type that we could travel on forever and not find any signs and like northeastern town names are the worst because they are so boring <laughs> and they feature multiple times some of those it's just terrible oh big lake so I'm scared register of deeds what what does that mean yeah the other one was the one outside of Boston wasn't it this could be the same stuff your property is our property where is 202 that would be nice to know because maybe if we can find it uh -huh. where is that oh here uh four and 202 should be close to each other 202 goes down here so does Connecticut also have the square I'm not 100% sure but uh, I think they do so we need to be careful mm, yeah let's we were on the five what well, where do we and now we're on the four there's a four and there's 202 very close by maybe is there a five as well? No? We might be here. After all, lobster. Yeah, that makes sense. But what? Now we're on the five again. Are you kidding me? Limerick. Where the heck is Limerick? I thought that's Ireland. Mm hmm. Southwick. Uh, 202 Limerick maybe no nowhere hmm where does 202 end oh it continues even even here Deerfield oh it continues up here all the way uh, but I don't think it's up there. So Limerick. It's A the way. And now we have so many signs all of a sudden, but huh, it doesn't help me. That's amazing. Lakeside. Ossipi Lake. I don't know that to be honest. Wait, did we come from here or is it just that many lakes here? Uh, I think we didn't come from here. Oh, Limerick, where are you? I hope I'm not going back because I'm really unsure. <laughs> I need to find Limerick. This is so sad. So sad. If you guys have any way to distinguish the northeastern states, let me know in the comments, please. Because this is a nightmare. <laughs> Even if you if you say something that might be clear, I might have forgotten it. <laughs> Because, um, yeah. Nitsboro? What is that? Waterboro. 
Baptist church, interesting. So far more. <laughs> That's indeed very unusual. Waterboro and Deer Pond. Man, I don't know what to do. What is faster? Try and find it on the map? Because I still have no idea which state we're in. Uh, if I knew the state, then oof, definitely will make sense to search it, but I'm not sure otherwise. I mean, it can't be Vermont and it can't be New Hampshire, but it can be everything else that is along the 202. And Limerick might not be on the 202 itself. That, that is why I am a little bit hesitant to search it. Entering Limerick, yeah, great. I made it, but hmm, what does it help me actually? <laughs> maybe I can find next town name, and maybe if I have two, then I find it. Or like, what is this? This is taking way too long, man. Shit. don't have three hours I said right oh no I went back oh no it happened all right time to find it so 202 is here and I think that we are rather in this somewhere in this area so it can't be New York and it can't be Pennsylvania so it has to be Connecticut or more east. All right, we follow the 202 and we look around it because we need to find Limerick, right? And it might be a few miles away. So that's what we do. <sighs> look at those town names, so boring, so boring. Like, one town name is more boring than the other. Um, Westfield. I'm pretty sure I've seen more than one town name because I checked some signs, but... Where is Limerick, please? <laughs> New Braintree. That's some cool town name. That's what we need. Not so boring. Warwick. Hmm. I need to do it at this zoom level. There's Richmond. Uh, another Richmond. Limerick, where are you? Man, that's sad. I just need to find the goddamn state. What is this? Makes me angry. Deerfield. Deerfield. No, I, I saw that on the map, not while playing. I mean, is it possible that I cannot see it? Hmm. North Berwick. Uh, we're now in Maine, so that is problem because we're not in Maine. Wait, no, we could be. We could be. I need to check it. I think. I don't have that confirmation. Oh, Waterboro. That's where we started, right? Um. Am I sure? I drove so long. Like... <sighs> Limerick? Which way did I go from the start? This way, right? West. Yeah, we should be in Maine. We should. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we... S wait, I went... 
I went down and up again. Are you kidding me? Oh wow, nice neighborhood. A lot of brick houses. But wow, they have a lot of the same style. And I've never seen this kind of coloring of uh, the bricks. So how to get out of here? Ah. Mm, I think we're... Wait, there's a yellow plate. It's not a yellow plate. Could this be New Mexico? Because, yeah, we have a dry climate here. But a very nice neighborhood. Why are Western neighborhoods always so freaking nice? How is it the shitty neighborhoods are always like east? <laughs> and especially in the south, unfortunately, the worst are there. Uh, Waterstone, what the heck is this? C-A-B-Q, what does that stand for? Where are you going? KAFD? What? Why are you using such weird abbreviations? Man, sick houses, man. That's like paradise to live in. Bust up, but for what? Hmm. It's not very well readable. But there's only one dry state that has yellow plates, I think. So, are we in Albuquerque or something like that? West Albuquerque. <laughs> okay, makes sense because this area looked so rich, it couldn't really be a small town, so... And further west we go. <laughs> uh, oh boy, how do I not know Julesburg? So that means we're probably not in Arizona, probably not in New Mexico. Oh, Colorado. Limon. Uh, where's Julesburg though? I want to clarify that. Uh, which side of the mountains are we? Uh, we cannot go over here. So bad coverage, really. Sterling. Sterling, Sterling. Isn't that up here? Yeah. I've heard that before, but not Schulzburg. But Schulzburg is on the border, and this is closer, so we have to be in Colorado. All right. Okay, back to a classic Eastern round. All right, here. This could be anywhere, really. We haven't gotten Michigan yet. And something with those trees. Uh, feels like if it, like, I feel like Michigan is sometimes a state that is imitating Southern trees, but then it has some kind of trees sprinkled in that don't make sense. And usually that seems to be a good clue to recognize it. But um, yeah, this, this feels like so temperate, like not warm, not cold. Like this could as well be Ohio or Indiana or Pens. Yeah, it doesn't feel Pennsylvania, but we're also on the highway. We don't have architecture this time to to um, see 
that it could be Pennsylvania. A water wheel. Oh, that's a bad name, <laughs> to be honest. Uh, I think we're gonna exit here and check out what is here. Uh, Thomas College, Waterville and Oakland, and oh no, oh no, not again in the Northeast. Oh, <laughs> makes me want to cry. If at least the Northeast would not have those. Wait, where did we go? What? How did that happen? We are on the main road. We need to go back there. I'm not doing this shit again. <laughs> I'm going south. Get out of here. Lions Road, Sydney. Water, Waterville? Right, I think it was Waterville. On the 105 or something like that. But what road are we on here? This has to be a US highway at least. Two one oh four. Yeah, but I don't care what that is. Where are we going if we go the other way? Ninety five. Ha! Augusta. Okay. Okay. Are we in Maine again? That's like crazy. Where is Augusta again? Ah, oh, here. Uh, one oh five. We we actually had one oh five before, right? Someone will. Uh, how? Augusta is south, so we need to be north of it, which means it can't be any other state. Good logic, Mr. Radox. Okay, what are those mountains? That looks rather unique. That's very interesting location. So does that make it a California location? Because this doesn't feel like Utah, nor does it feel like New Mexico, even though it's not impossible, but sometimes seems off with the vegetation. So it probably is. It's even though it feels very deserty. We're probably not in a typical desert state. Because, yeah, something is, is off here. And there's a lot of traffic. <laughs> there's a lot of traffic. Even in such a region. That might be a further indication we're in California. But we definitely don't want to guess on this one. Because in the west there's just so many elevation changes and therefore the vegetation changes all the time. So very risky to go for that. Uh, we're descending going west. Yeah, that's also a thing that we can do a lot in California. If we are in the Sierra Nevada, but we're probably not in the Sierra Nevada because this is too dry for it. So we might be like some of the on some of those smaller ranges within California. I'm guessing for now, but we need further evidence. Ah, uh, what was that? Miranda Pine. Miranda, that just sounds like... It's more like a Spanish sounding name, right? USFS, Pine Canyon Station. Pine Canyon. I've heard that before, but where is it? Tepus Get Road. Oh, Bakersfield. Yeah, that does make sense. Maricopa. Okay. 
And we are then somewhere here. Oh no. Oh, okay. Is it Maricopa? No, I, that's Mariposa. I always ugh, mix them up. Actually, not that far away from LA. That's why. Huh, I crossed this mountain range actually. Going this way or this way? This way actually. Okay. Um. All right. Next one. Fifth and Oak. Huh. Ah, there's a town over there. And Fifth Street. That's never bad. So. You know you're in a small town, so you might find a state road. Wow, they are heavy on the littering here. Uh, and also that you don't kill this bridge. And it's very rusty. Stoffel. That, 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 sound, that name sounds very like Swiss or like German. It's a Swiss name actually, so maybe some Swiss people went here. Industrial Park, hmm, detour. Five seventy. Hmm. Well, well, well. Where are we? Get sweet on maple. Sounds like a Canadian thing. Maybe we are not that far away from Canada. What does that sign say? Ultra storage. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Merch of PA. Well, that has to be because Le Luzerne, another Swiss town name. Mm, but there's multiple Luzernes in the US, but this says PA, so. so is that already good enough of a clue or not? I don't know. Is it? Do I really want to risk it? Man, I'm at almost two hours now. Wait, how many? Is it three challenges? Oh, fuck. Man. Landscape does feel like it could be PA, but if we are in PA, it shouldn't be that hard to find a confirmation, especially in a town like this. So I'm not going to risk it on this one. I am not in the mood. I'm so far again, so it's so risky. <laughs> but I'm way slower than last time, even though last time we had this so brutal California road. This time we had brutal roads in like, what was that? Uh, eerie insurance. Cozy comfort. Uh, can something say PA, then I'm okay with it. But of course, when I look for that, I spend so much time again. Kelly. This feels different though than the other PA rounds that we had so far. I'm not sure what that means. Last time it was so east, I was really surprised. This feels more east to me than the other one, but it might not be. Mm. Yeah, I mean, do I want to risk it or not? I don't, but it seems like we're in a pretty big town. Philly, it says Philly, but uh, might also be a regional thing, you never know. 
give me one more PA and I go for it please game wait what that said NC or oh, what was that oh, no turn Hmm, interesting town, man. What is, whoa, big church, man. Scranton. Are we in freaking Scranton? Okay, seems like it. Okay, we were outside of it and we went into it. That's interesting. We reached a major city by just going some direction. That's cool. Fla we're in flammable. I think it's very dangerous. No one should live here. Oh, that's a good sign. 77 and 56. And Junction City. Wait. Where is that again? Is that Kansas or... Uh, no, that's tech. Isn't it Texas actually? Junction City. There's something with Junction down here. Oh, it's just Junction and not Junction City. And there's no 77 here, so we're not here. Um, but it should be possible to find all that. So we're further north. Maybe Kansas. Maybe it is Kansas. Uh, do we have sign on the other side? Because uh yeah we do because another town name that i know would be great el dorado isn't that texas though hmm wait a sec el dorado texas is where el dorado where is it again Texas is too big. Damn it. Marion, Macpherson, and El Dorado. And we are in Lincolnville. That's also a boring town name. <laughs> I'm bashing town names today. Where the heck is 77 goes south and 56 goes west? Like, where could that be? 54 is here, 77 is here. Mm-hmm. Junction City, okay. Council Grove, Marion, El Dorado. It is Kansas. It should really be, right? Because we are far from any border here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We eat this. Bye bye, Lincolnville. And hello there. Interesting mountains that make me think Alaska. Oh boy. No, this could take a long time to find confirmation. Oh boy. We all oh, were on the Dalton Highway. I think that's good enough, right? I'm gonna risk it. Oh yeah, we're up there. Holy shit. Okay, we're gonna go downhill a little bit. Lots of trees here. Oh, we have some of those pine trees that are more like... Make me think Northwestern or... Oh, this might be Minnesota this time. You know why? This sign and this building in combination just makes me think Minnesota. Also this house. They have some unique architecture. I was already going to say it might be in the northwest maybe, but now that I've seen this building, I'm like, I could really be, but we have US Highway 2. That's a problem because I'm pretty sure that doesn't run through Minnesota. Because high numbers and low numbers are close to the coast, mostly. So 
So that's a problem. So are we in the northeast again? Are you kidding me? Is it never gonna stop? <laughs> this terror that just asked me to fail again with this stupid Londonderry town name that is in multiple state. Ah, come on, give me a sign. This feels quite desolate for the northeast, so we're probably quite a bit away from the coast. So this feels more like Maine, like just because there's no nothing going on. <laughs> it's good enough to make it Maine. <laughs> But, I don't know. We need to find clues. And if it's northeast, which is most likely going to be now. <sighs> Civil War monument, really. <laughs> we have the 95 again. I start to hate this road. <laughs> 158. Mm, Sherman and Island Falls. The, we are on the two and the 158 is here. Uh, and what else is there? Holton. That is in Maine, I think. Let's check Maine. Where is the two? Here. The two goes. Where does it go? Hmm. Island Falls, Holton. Yeah, we are really north this time. You can see it in the trees. It didn't it feel very south. What was that? Chattahoochee? Really? Wait, is that the one in North Georgia? I always forget the name. Yeah, it is. That is it. Okay, but we need to make sure it's in Georgia, because it might not be. It's too risky to do that. Chattahoochee. Cool. This doesn't feel Georgia at all, right? <laughs> but it is because this region is very... Appalachian and mountainous, and so it's not, it's very different from Georgia. It, scenic overlook, and this might as well be in North Carolina or some kind of. Uh, I'm not sure exactly if the whole thing of Chattahoochee is in Georgia, uh, but uh, Hightower Creek, Georgia. Cl Clayton, that's also a county name. Clarksville and Helen, I know those towns. Helen is here. So can we confirm from that that we are actually here? Uh, 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 uh. There's Clayton, oh boy. We go further south, we're in Clayton, but we have a Georgia sign here. But we went south from the start. We're on the 76 and we reached the 197. So let's find out where that is exactly. All right. Oh no. Wait a second. Oh no, it should be fine, right? Let's that's just county line or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, 196, it doesn't go anywhere, right? Yeah, so it has to be Georgia. Come on, come on. Okay. Good. Okay, I need to turn on the lights. To be honest, it gets dark. 10 more, 10 more, 10 more. So, 
How late is it? Okay. Why is that Cleveland and John? Hmm. No idea for this one so far. Dr. Howard Hawk, Hank, Ellen, Gymnasium. Hmm. I have no idea what state this is so far. I'm seeing PA landscape, but it doesn't feel like PA. <laughs> but we haven't seen a lot, so it might still be. Mm, let's go west. Because here there are signs. That might already be enough. Southeast energy. Yeah, I can see that. Lynchburg. Uh, oh, are we in Virginia again? Yeah, looks like it. Yeah, there's Lynchburg in Virginia. So, where is that again? Yeah, I mean, we have Virginia state signs. So, it has to be. Oh, ho, 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 fuck. So close. Oh, boy. Are we back? Oh, boy. Can I really be sure just because it, there's snow that this is freaking Alaska? Let's check plate. <laughs> Can I be sure? I can, right? Mainly because there's no asphalt. And it says Alaska. So I think I'm good, right? Yeah, we're up there again. <laughs> wow, we were there twice. That's insane. Was probably the Dalton Highway again. All right, we're in Flatistan also known as Illinois, maybe. <laughs> like, so extremely flat. It often turns out to be Illinois. Especially if it has that agricultural feel and it doesn't feel warm, it doesn't feel really cold. So somehow, even though the weather seems pretty bad, adopt the highway. No, thank you. Uh, what do we have here? Some kind of highway. US Highway 59. Murray County. Fifty nine Murray County. Murray might be a town name, it might not be. We don't know. Uh, and we don't know the state, so it's not really worth checking if 59 is in. Uh, what? This is a their community. Fulda. That's a German town name, actually. <laughs> That's interesting. Welcome to Fulda, home of the Wood Duck, home of the Fulda Raiders. Hmm. I would see Wisconsin for that because we have German town name and everything. So, and there's a lot of German heritage uh, in Wisconsin. Oh, Minnesota. Okay, I guess that makes also sense. Um, Murray County. No idea. Does this say anything where we are? Windham and Slayton. Hmm, should I find one of those? Because what if I cross the border? I'm getting, I'm getting anxious slowly. You can see, right? Uh, Fifty-nine into into Minnesota yeah that's actually on the border here for example but we have the 62 and that's here and 
we didn't far drive that far, but we are close to the border again. <clears throat> so I don't mind checking. Oh, nice house. Feels very warm climate-ish. Okay, feels Hawaii. Because at first I felt like I felt like Florida, but now that I see so much water, it could be uh, Hawaii. Oh, we need confirmation. Because I feel like Hawaii lacks a little bit a very distinguishable neighborhood. It often feels a little bit like Florida, doesn't it? But also, I don't know, not really. So it's weird. Oh boy, what? It says California. But it might just be a company working here. But it might actually be California then. Huh, interesting. Um, all right. Yeah, we are probably not in Hawaii. Because we don't see any soil or so something. And that's usually the best clue in Hawaii. And we're in a kind of a neighborhood that's so close to the coast. So it's hard to see that. Um, all the landscape here is man-made. So it's very hard to see what what is natural and what is not. So, oh, Campo, <laughs> that sounds like California. But how can we be sure? Because, yeah, it feels like Southern California, right? Still would be nice to have a confirmation. Like just one thing, just one time California is enough for me to have it. Like we had one time California, but I want it a second time. Nah, I don't know. I don't know. What do we do? This seems like a never ending neighborhood. Like it's crazy. What is this? Well, I think this will help. <gasps> what? It's Corpus Christi. Are you kidding me? What if I went to California? Are you kidding me? No, that can't be right. Yeah, this says California again. Wait, it might be another Corpus Christi. <laughs> what? Now it gets confusing. Wow, man, what is this place? Like this feels... This is not enough Kona to be uh, Texas anywhere, even Corpus Christi. Like it can't be, right? But then I'm scared because there's palms now. <laughs> and that's scary because I know there's palms in Corpus... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Los Angeles. Yeah, we have to be California. <laughs> wow, what a round, man. So scary. At first I thought it was Hawaii and then this and then that. Okay. Thanks. Okay, last challenge. What will we get? What will we get? We got tractors. But that doesn't help. Hendrickson or something. Oh boy. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh yeah, this is the right way to go. <laughs> Bolivar. <laughs> okay. Interesting. China. China. 
Missouri. I guess that's good enough because we see in Bolivar twice. And why would you say Bolivar Missouri if it was not in Missouri? And it feels like it's possible here. Right. Yeah, should be. Let's try. I'm a little bit scared. But yeah, I've heard this town name before. But I didn't know anymore that it was there. We have some wind mills. No, not mills. What are they called? Wind? I don't know. Is it mills? Oh, I don't know. It's pretty dry here and apparently quite windy on a general basis. And this feels like kind of like Western Oklahoma or Western Texas, some kind of that. It's probably one of the two. Maybe Colorado, but mm, I don't feel like it. Maybe also extreme southwestern Kansas, because that area is also quite dry, I think. Whoa, now it gets very fieldy. Hmm, there's a town here. Tractor. This is tractor land and truck land uh, as well. Boggy Creek. <laughs> it box. Malcolm. Memorial Bridge, I have no idea. What is this? Welding services? I think I'm checking more, more Okla City. That means probably Oklahoma, right? Does it? East, so it's west of Oklahoma. Is there Tuttle somewhere? There's Tuttle. Okay. Wow, it's so close to Oklahoma City. Wow. It's that dry already. It's crazy. Um, okay. No fails. Three more. No fails. Fails are not allowed. Pearl River. I have heard of that before, but as usual, I have no idea anymore. What? Whoa. Wait, isn't, wait, that flag is Mississippi, isn't it? Wait, I'm not sure anymore. But, no, 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 no. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is Mississippi, but I need confirmation because I'm not fucking up this one. I am not going to fry trim. <laughs> yeah, are we even in southern Mississippi then? Uh, Baptist Church, but it doesn't say the state. I, w I really want an official sign here. I'm not going to mess with that. Because what if it's Louisiana or something? And I'm going south, so it's actually unlikely that I cross the border. Uh, hmm. Collision Pro. Affordable tree service. Oh boy. Oh boy. Mm -hmm. Well, it shouldn't take too long anymore, so I'm I don't I don't really care about time at this point. Uh, but I want the sign. Just give me a circle. Give me a circle stage road to confirm it. What, what if I have that flag wrong in mind? I really need to be careful. I really need to. 
Because if I fail this one again, like I'm not sure if I can ever do it again because <laughs> I would be devastated. <laughs> like for real. I mean, last time it was okay. I didn't know if I could do it easily and it turned out to be harder than I expected. So I could live with it, but could I live with it another time? Hmm, I'm not sure if I fail this one again. Man, it's populated, but why is there no street sign? Perish! Oh my god, that's scary. Because we might be in Louisiana after all. What if we are on the border? That is some scary, because oh, oh pick a and drag. Uh huh. Highway eleven. Is there a US eleven, or does it mean? Oh, there is pick a <laughs> There's Carrier. We saw that, right? We saw that on the star or something. So we are close to the water indeed. Where did I see Carrier? Here. Yeah, we are here then. Mississippi, brother. Mm -hmm. Very close to the water. Okay, second last one. We're on the main highway. Makes me comfortable. Tea and land. Okay, I'm not gonna go for that, but. It feels like it could be right. Mohawk. Yeah, fuck off with the sign. I don't care. I want to have official signs. Just give it to me. Bridgeport. Wait, Alabama? Is it? Really? Huh. Now this gets interesting. Looks like another failed potential road here. Let's exit and uh, see what we wait, 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 wait. This might be helpful. Usually, those are not, but it is Alabama. But man, it's high mountains for Alabama. Holy shit, that is unusual. So, we must be in the north. Uh, wait, that's such a weird sign. What? It's a tourist sign. Bridgeport. Appalachian. So let's check if 277 is up here. And if it's not close to the border, I don't give a damn. I'm gonna guess here. It has to be Alabama. Right. Right? It has to. Oh, fuck! So close again! <sighs> Bridgeport. Man. Wow, that's so close to Rome. Holy. The mountains are that high there? Okay, interesting. Uh, young Plumbing. This is the boss. We have found our boss, location number 50, and it feels like it's an easy one. It feels like it's an easy one. Oh, what do we have here? Cool Spring Township School. There's not that many states that have townships, so that narrows it down. <gasps> Michigan City. Is Michigan City in Michigan? <laughs> I don't trust anyone anymore. 94 Junction. US 421. That's actually an amazing thing here. So I think... We're gonna be here, but let's make sure. There's 94. We're 321. I don't see that so far. So that's rather odd. Um, hmm. <laughs> um, wait, it's 421, not 321. So 
it needs to be close to 94 and it needs to be 421 I don't see that scary so we go here and check it out check it out really quick Detroit okay that's that's pretty good sign one more maybe to I would like to know where I am exactly because I'm not gonna mess with that Ch now it says Chicago <laughs> which of course is also possible the 94 so I would like to have some small name like maybe the town name and I would like no to know where 421 is uh, apparently it's Michigan City but where the heck is that it needs to be on the 94 because it's literally right there I think wait not on Indiana are you kidding me are you kidding me wait a second Four. Oh my gosh it's Indiana are you kidding me that was so risky and it has to be here right because 94 and 421 is both here so it cannot be any other right and it has those CR roads here yeah, it should be here. Come on. Yes. Oh my god. Who would not went who would not go Michigan on this one? Like except of course if you know it. But it's so close to Michigan it's actually not. I've heard this town before and I really really thought it's there. But I wanted to double check and oh boy I need to just stop the time but the time this time is not worth anything but eh, it's yeah I did it okay okay cool nice we have a bad time so that's kind of great because it gives incentive to improve it so and if I like if I play extremely risky then uh, <laughs> then uh, this time is so easily beatable like even last time I was much faster I lost a lot of time in the northeastern rounds so let's go through which states did we have which did we not have we had Alaska we did not have Washington I think not have Oregon not have Idaho not have Nevada not have Utah we didn't get a lot of western well actually if I think about it it feels like we had quite a few Western ones we had California we had a lot of Texas right do we have Arizona not really I think not really New Mexico we had Colorado with Wyoming we also didn't have Montana I think no South Dakota no Nebraska Mm. we had no Iowa this time last time we had a lot of it mm, no Wisconsin again second time 50 rounds without Wisconsin uh, did we have Illinois did we no I think not we had a lot of southern locations once again all those states not South Carolina we, no we had one the one that I could guess very fast on but do we have North Carolina I think we didn't have that we had more than one Re Virginia no West Virginia luckily because that state is kind of annoying <laughs> in geogas we had Kentucky yeah we had Lexington as a big city with Scranton in PA um, we had Indiana now in the end <laughs> in the end Indiana <laughs> makes sense uh, no Ohio right even though I suspected it on some rounds we didn't have it 
no Michigan again 50 rounds without Michigan I think yeah no Delaware not a surprise no New Jersey again not a surprise small states no Rhode Island no Connecticut we had a lot of Maine man and we had Vermont, we had New Hampshire once, we had Massachusetts once, no New York, I think, yeah, no New York, I think, yeah, big state, but it doesn't come up. Okay, no Hawaii as well, we had Florida though, so yeah that's it so yeah even though i played a little bit safer especially in the end i hope you still liked it and um yeah if i play next time i want to risk more but it's like it's like not that easy because if you don't have any sign you cannot really risk it right unless the landscape is extremely specific but yeah, we, we will see. I definitely want to do one more of those sometime when I have more time to record or like this. Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, if I rush it, I can definitely easily do it before two hours. If I risk it, I can probably approach 130. Cheer up your head, uh, 125. And I still think he, as well as I could beat that as maybe um, yeah the thing is I just don't know too much about the license plates and that is a problem because that can help you give very fast rounds that can really help out in that thing so yeah I have to go now it's time thanks for watching guys see you bye bye